U.S. Army Garrison Japan conducted its second annual downed aircraft mass casualty exercise in collaboration with various units on the installation and host nation emergency service personnel and fire department. The important thing here is to so that our emergency responders, one, can maintain proficiency, and two, to be able to work with our host nation fire departments. So if we have a major disaster, that we are familiar with each other's processes, procedures, equipment, and we can mitigate an incident much more effectively. The training included a joint exercise involving first responders from Camp Zama, Sagamihara, and Zama cities to test their capability to respond to an incident, gauge the coordination among the three organizations, and also to enhance other directorates' roles in the event of an emergency. This is my first time participating in the exercise. It was a good exercise. I'd like to facilitate interaction with the people who participated in the exercise more and build a good relationship with them. This way, we can work seamlessly with other units to rescue injured people in case of any emergency. It was my first time to join a bilateral exercise like this. I think we played our roles much smoother than we originally thought. However, it would be better if we could clarify certain things, such as who plays what role, or where to go for finding accurate information. Hopefully we can make that clear and enhance those for next time. It was a great exercise. We conduct similar exercises every year. However, we don't go into this much detail, like putting blankets on top of the bodies or making sure those first responders take a rest and remain hydrated. I observed the exercise and learned a lot today. This training exercise coordination comes by way of a mutual memorandum of understanding, which was signed by both cities several years ago. It's important to continue to work together, to look at our processes, to train together, not only academically wise, but also from a practical standpoint, which you saw here today. Reporting for U.S. Army Garrison Japan Public Affairs, this is Major Lisa Argo.